Hello again, and I'm going to do wind energy calculations now. So if you're confused or you have no idea where to start, follow along. And remember, you can always pause the video if I'm going too fast or something like that. Alright, so it says complete the following problem, showing all of your work. You can use a calculator, and on this sheet it's actually correct. One megawatt hour, I think in the last video I said milliwatt hour, which that's not even a thing. So one megawatt hour is a thousand kilowatt hours. All right, so we've got a wind turbine that is rated at 1.5 megawatts. This means that with sufficiently high winds, it will produce 1.5 megawatts of power in an hour. All right, the installed cost of this turbine is $1.5 million. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do, let's see, it says the turbine's rated and it's blah, blah, blah. How much energy would it produce in kilowatt hours? in a year all right so we're going to start out with this 1.5 mega watt all right and it can produce that much in one hour so i'm going to put times one hour all right so now i'm going to multiply i'm going to do the x and I'm draw the line here and i'm going to change hours i'm going to convert the hours into a, a year basically all right, so I'm going to go from hours to days, draw another one, and I'm going to go day to a year. All right, there are 24 hours in one day, and there are 365 days in one year. All right, so now in my calculator, 1.5 times 24 times 365, all right, I have <coughs> 13,140 megawatt hours per one year. Alright, now I need to convert it from megawatt hours into kilowatt hours, and the way that you do that is you're just going to multiply it by a thousand. Alright, so overall the answer is 1.314 times 10 to the 7th. This should be kilowatt hours per year. All right, and I'm running out of space here. All right, so we have it's 1.314 times 10 to the seventh, which is about 13 million me uh, kilowatt hours per year. All right, the wind turbine has a capacity factor that's equal to 0.38. That means that over a year, it'll only produce 30% of its theoretical maximum energy. Yikes. All right, so we're gonna take this one point 314 times 10 to the 7th kilowatt hours per year and I'm going to multiply it times its capacity factor which is 0.38 and that is going to give me 1.314 second e to the 7th times 0.38 all right and that gives me 4993200 so it looks like 4,993,200, and this is kilowatt hours per year. All right, so I'm going to round this to uh, 5 million kilowatt hours per year. All right. So now let's answer the next question. U.S. annual electricity consumption is projected to increase by 1.5 trillion kilowatts per year. How many 1.5 megawatt wind turbines would need, be needed to supply 10% of this additional energy? And assume that the turbine is still operating at a capacity factor of 0.38. All right, so what I'm going to do is, is the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply this 1.5 trillion and remember trillion is times 10 to the 12 kilowatt hours per year times 0 0.10 so that would be 10 percent of the energy the additional energy so now my calculator i'm going to do 1.5 second e to the 12th times 0 0.10 all right and that gives me 1.5 times 10 to the 11th kilowatt hours per year. <coughs> Alright, so now I'm going to convert 
or basically you're just going to divide this number, the 1.5 times 10 to the 11 kilowatt hours per year, by the answer that we got up here, because this is how many kilowatt hours this wind turbine can produce. Okay, so now let's do, actually we're going to use this number because this is when it's operating at 100% 100 capacity. So let's divide this by 5 million. Alright, so in my calculator I'm going to divide that by 5 million. Alright, and the answer is, is we're going to have to install 30,000 wind turbines. That seems like a lot of wind turbines that we're going to have to install just for this amount of energy. Alright, so now it says cal calculate the cost of installing these wind turbines. 30,000 wind turbines. Times, up here at the top it says, the install cost of this turbine is $1.5 million. So times $1.5 million. So in my calculator I'm going to do 30,000 times $1.5 million. Alright, so then I got $45,000 million, which doesn't make a lot of sense. So let's convert this into something else. So let's do 30,000 times 1.5 times 10 to the 6th. Alright, so 30,000 times 1.5 second E to the 6th. Alright, it's going to give me 4.5 times 10 to the 10th dollars. Alright, so it's basically almost, you know, a billion dollar or trillion dollars. Alright, so assuming that the electric energy produced by these turbines is worth five cents per kilowatt hour, these turbines would generate electric energy worth 7.5 billion dollars per year. Calculate the simple payback period for these wind turbines, and the payback period is the time it takes for the system's net benefits to equal its cost. Alright, so it's going to cost us 4.5 times 10 to the 10th dollars and they want us to calculate how long it's going to take to basically do that <coughs> all right so i'm going to do this uh 4.5 times 10 to the 10th divided by 7.5 times 10 to the 9th all right so let's divide this 4.5 second e to the 10 divided by 7.5 second e to the 9th. Alright, it's approximately 6 years. Alright, so it's going to have to take about 6 years for them to pay back this amount of, of money. Which seems like not that much of a long time considering on the PV system earlier it was going to take like 50 something years. Alrighty, so now I'm going to flip on to the back. Well, actually it's just the second page of my... And remember, if you're if I'm going too fast for you or something, you can always pause and then try to catch up with me. All right, so now we've got another question that is about a wind turbine. So it says a wind turbine has a rating of 3.5 megawatts per one hour. To build this one turbine, it costs two million dollars. Yikes, these things are expensive. All right, so how much energy will it produce if it's running all day at full capacity? All right, so it's exactly the same that we did earlier. So it's 3.5 megawatts per one hour and we're just going to convert the hours into days and then we're going to convert the days into years and I'm assuming that's what it wants how much energy will it produce if it's running all day uh, so it does want days Alright, so we're going to have to uh, just take off the hours part. That's fine. We'll probably have to convert it into years eventually. Alright, so it just wants days. Alright, so there's 24 hours in one day. Alright, so 3.5 times 24. It's going to be 84 megawatts per day. Okay. Alright, so it says, to be realistic, if the wind turbine is running at a capacity factor of 0.4, how much will it produce for one day? So again, 84 megawatts per day. And we're going to multiply it times the capacity factor, which is 0.4. So 
Alright, so now my calculator, I'm going to do 84 times 24. That is uh, 33.6 megawatts per day. Alright, if a town consumes 100 megawatt hours of energy in one day, how many wind turbines should they build, assume they're running at a 0.4 capacity factor? Alright, so what you want to do is, is you want to take the 100 megawatt hours per one day, and you're basically going to divide it by the 33.6. If you want to do the factor label, this is what you do. You would say in one day, it takes this many megawatt hours. So one day is 33.6. All right, and when you do 100 divided by 33.6, you basically get 2.98, which is approximately three wind turbines. All right, so now we've got three wind turbines. And it cost them two million dollars to build each one. So how much is it going to cost this town? Three wind turbines times two million a piece. It's going to cost them six million dollars. All right. So now it says the local electricity company charges their com consumers or customers ten cent per kilowatt hour, but only makes a profit of 0 0.05 kilowatt hours. What will the payback period be in days for the company? Year? The payback period is the time it takes for the system's net benefit to equal its cost. Alright, so the town uses a hundred, oh crap, that's a thousand, a hundred megawatt hours in one day. Alright, and it gives us the amount of money that they make per kilowatt hour. So guess what? We're going to have to convert megawatt hours into kilowatt hours all right and one megawatt hour is actually equal to a thousand kilowatt hours all right so let's see what that is what's a hundred times a thousand it's gonna be a hundred thousand kilowatt hours per day all right so now let's see how much money do they make? They only make $0.05 per kilowatt hour. So let's convert this from kilowatt hours into dollars. Alright, so for one kilowatt hour, they only make $0.05, or they make five cents per every kilowatt hour. So now I'm going to do 100,000 times 0 0.05, and that means that they make $5,000 per day. Alright, so if they make $5,000 per day, and it's going to cost them $6 million to build these three wind turbines, we're going to take the $6 million, so $6 million, which looks like that, dollars, divided by the $5,000 that they make every day, So 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, divided by 5,000. Alright, it's going to take them 1,200 days to basically make their money back. Alright, so uh, they also want to know how many years is it going to take them to make their money back. If it takes them 1,200 days, we can just convert the days into years using the conversion factor of 365 days in one year. All right, so 1,200 divided by 365, it's going to take them about 3. Point, oops, that's a two, 3.29 years to uh, basically pay this back. All right, so 3.29 to pay back, and that's a 3 again, remember? All right, so again, if they start out, they use 100 megawatt hours per day. I converted that into kilowatt hours because they charge per kilowatt hour per day. So I converted that, I got 100,000 kilowatt hours per day. Then they make five cents per every kilowatt hour, so I multiplied those two together and they got that they make $5,000 a day. Which is insane to think about that they make $5,000 per day. But whatever. So six million 
divided by the 5,000. Where did I get the 6 million? That's how much it would cost them to build these wind turbines. Divided by 5,000, because that's how much they make per day. It'll take them 1,200 days to make back their money. And then I divided it by 365 to get it into years. All right, so if you have any questions about that, let me know. Remember, if I go too fast or something like that, you can always pause the video or you know rewatch certain sections of it. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day.